Hello everybody and welcome back once more to Sly 2 Band of Thieves. I am the Outback Al and we're here on the second to last chapter episode, whatever you want to call it, for this game. Episode 7 where we're gonna take down Jean Bisson up in the even further north. So let's, let's get in here, check it out. Things just weren't right up in Canada. Random acts of violence were popping up like weeds, <laughs> and the Northern Lights, well, they just weren't right. One night they'd be brighter than ever, and the next, gone. In Nunavut Bay, I overheard talk between Jean Bassan and his mysterious partner, Arpeggio. Somehow, those two are behind it all. But Tracking he wasn't the there, source of the disturbance okay. was easy. By simply following the lights, we were led north to an immense lumber camp. The sheer number of fallen trees advertised Jean Bisson's presence and that he was in possession of the clockwork talons. Mm -hmm. The Thievius Raccoonus makes numerous references to the talons slicing through plates of steel. A skilled lumberjack like Bisson could clear a forest in hours while wielding the artifacts. Those talons have got to go, both to finally do away with clockwork and to save the environment from his twisted sense of progress. The world just doesn't need to make space for another strip mall. Yep. All right. Man, he's from the north, eh? Okay. This is the other side of Canada, I guess. Uh, I don't think I picked up any extra loot. What? A, what else? Ugh. We got so many things to buy. I'm gonna actually have to take time to to get a lot of this stuff. So at a certain point, I'm gonna do the recon first, and then I'm gonna actually take some time okay. to get a lot of so stuff. So here's what we know: one, Arpeggio's blimp is on its way to pick up a battery from Jean Bisson, and two, the only way we'll get a crack at Arpeggio's clockwork brain is by finding a way to sneak aboard his blimp. But before we do that, we'll need to snag the clockwork talons off Jean Bisson. Time right. is short, and we've got a lot to accomplish. True, true, but first things first. This lumber camp isn't on any of my maps. I need you to poke around and take some recon photos. They'll help to get my sensors oriented. No problem. Okay. Recon photos, I got covered. In anticipation of the icy climate, I took the liberty of modifying your cane. It can now separate into two smaller canes. Useful for ice climbing. I don't Try know ascending how he did that, to the top okay. of that sheet of ice. Just jump and hit the circle button to dig in. This is the only thing that anyone ever does in this game. Jump and hit the circle button. Alright. I'm not hearing any bottles, so. Okay, can't jump out of the way. I gotta just walk around those things. Oh. Hmm. Forgot that I set that up. Uh the other thing. You know what? We could have the knockout dive, I guess. Anyway, let's get up here. And it's good to see my cane upgrade perform so well in the field. I kind of thought he was going to, uh, I could really use the reconnaissance. Ooh, hello. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Okay, I think one of my buttons is a little stuck. Might be what's going on here. Is it a difference of elevation causing that to happen? Okay, well that's not gonna work. Well, at the very least I can start to grab some of these things. God, no one's got any glowing pockets. Alright, heading out to these places. Here's something. I need it. Is it below me? Well, that's no good. Can't follow me out here. Ok, 
Okay. Let's go. We'll do our recon work and then we will deal with the rest of it. Sometimes people hide in those spots. Blowing pockets, but I still gotta get every single coin that I can. Ugh. Hmm. Uh, how do I get up there? Oh, there's one over here at least. Ah, shit. Hmm, I want you. Okay. Alright, what do we got around here? Oh, there's one. Hmm, I want to go after you. You get a glowing pocket or anything? Oh my god. Okay, again, I am not clicking the button to uh, activate that uh, smoke thing. Something's up with my controller right now. Ooh, that's good. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna have to come back for a lot of this stuff, I think. Sapphire's not as good as a ruby, but it's still worth something. Stop bugging me. I... This. Okay. It's coming that way. I'm gonna jump up here. Catch me today. Don't duck. Alright. There we go. Those saw blades look particularly old. 
I guess this logging camp has been around for a while. Makes sense. He's an old guy. Probably sticks around with a lot of old equipment. Alright. Yeah, this thing is all the way over there. Pockets on the way? I don't think they can follow me down hill, so that's something, I guess. Close to somebody. Who was I close to? That's weird. That's half of those. Got some cash. Let's finish up with uh, the bears and whatnot. Whew. Okay, got lucky I knocked him out first. Good shot. This place is bear country, all right. Interesting. He's putting out a slight radio signature. Interesting. Alright. Last place is probably Jean Besson's actual location. Don't run into Mr. Bear. Don't run into Mr. Bear. There you go. Ooh, big gold bar. Nice. If I'm not mistaken, I also heard a little something around here. I'm gonna want that. Oop, bear. Bentley, I know you okay, got a minion. Okay, that should do it. Now for the real point of interest. 
Head for that lighthouse and try to find a way to sneak in. Okay, I will do that right after this guy. Yes, nice. Won't go through here. All right, we're getting some good stuff. I think we're going to be able to buy something pretty quick. But... Participants. Bullseye! I'll post the clockwork talons as a trophy. Oh. That should bring in the competition. Although, who am I kidding, eh? I'm gonna win just like every other year. <laughs> oh, it's tough being this tough. It sure is, yeah. Head back to the safe house. Okay. We need to talk about these lumberjacks. Bit of recon. We got a good amount of bottles. We got some cash so we can start working our way down that list of supplies that I've been neglecting. I think we can, we can well, keep guys, this together a little John bit. Well, guys, John Bisson has unknowingly thrown down the gauntlet. With the Clockwork Talons as a trophy, mm -hmm. we'd be fools not to participate in his lumberjack games. Fools! Fortunately, due to frequent avalanches, a log chopping guide was frozen in a wall of ice not far from our position. Sly, you're in charge of acquiring the book. I'm okay. sure it will prove invaluable. Now, we're all aware that Arpeggio's blimp is coming to pick up another battery. Mm -hmm. To sneak aboard without incident, I'd recommend we pull a Trojan horse okay. and stow away inside the battery. However, the location of the device is still a mystery. We need some inside Why would I not be information. In the lighthouse? So, working together, you two will infiltrate the Moose Guard's secret RC combat club. Ooh. Cool. Those guys all work in the lighthouse. If you win the battle, I'm sure they'll talk. Despite his antique mind, Jean Bisson's no fool. To keep tabs on him, we'll need to bug his house. Steal okay. the radio tags off local bears and then jerry-rig cool. them into a sensor array. It's a challenging set of tasks, and that blimp's on its way. Let's get to work. Okay, let's get to work. First things first, though. Let's see how much more money I need to get. Probably a lot. Oof. Well, I got enough for the thief reflexes. That's pretty good. I'm gonna grab that. I I need to spend some time getting the actual money at this point. What does this do? 
Slow time to a crawl. Go ahead, bird. Ha-ha! I'm unstoppable now. There you are. Just standing here, huh? Giving me money? Is that what you're doing? That's what you're doing here. Okay. I'll be back whenever I get the rest of these bottles and that, and uh, a lot more cash. to get up on top of John Bisson's house. I don't have a ton of money yet, but I might have a way to get the last bottle. Maybe! Yes! All right. Well, I still don't have a ton of money yet. I've stolen a lot of items, but I have gotten all the bottles, so we might as well start uh, getting a move on for some of these missions. Grab this guy's stuff first. Oof, nice. Okay. Shouldn't take too long to uh get where I need to go. Eh. Alright, my thoughts are we'll do Sly's mission real quick. And then we'll grab a special item near Chambazon's house, and then the area have been tagged we'll get with radio else. tracking devices. That's pretty if cool. If you could snag enough of them, we should be able to set up a receiver array around Jean Bisson's house. I'm always up for bugging someone's home. The well, first step is crawling into that bear cave and stealing the goods. Okay. I'm on it. You have a glowing pocket. I want that glowing pocket. Not bad. Alright, let's get into a bear cave. Ooh, wow. The radio transmitters have all been tagged in their mouths. Definitely don't want to wake anyone. You'll have to sneak up and pickpocket it while they're yawning. Sounds safe. Stay clear of the thin, crackly ice. Walking on it is sure to wake the bears. I'll keep that in mind. Okay. Super stealth mission. Six of these. I don't know why I'm whispering. They can't hear me. Okay. I don't know how you can do de stealth dental work, but I'm doing it. hear any of this, I guess. Alright, one more. One more, and we should be able to get out of this death trap bear cave. Really? 
The one time the circle button doesn't work? Please tell me I don't have to do it all. Oh, god damn it. Okay. <sighs> Alright. Alright. Try and reverse order this time. Maybe. No. No way I'm catching on to that. So far, let's just not fuck it up at the end. climby thing, but really, you need to be on the ice the whole time. Alright, we're good. Only you could have pulled that off. Yep. Head outside and I'll fill you in on the next step. God! Oh! You gotta be kidding me with that. I hate these hooks sometimes. Oh, really? Make me do this all over again. Can't just take it from when I got them all. No, that would be too easy. Third time's a charm, I guess. once they added in Canada, but who am I to complain? Alright. That's the last one. Only you could have pulled that off. Oh my god, why did you launch me right there? Oh my god. Don't like the bear cave. Alright, let's plant some bugs. To form a receiver array, you'll have to place the radio transmitters in precise locations around Jean Bissant's base of operations. All right. Seems easy enough. Once you're in position, hit the circle button to place the transmitter. Okay. Easy enough. can't get some coin while we're at it. Well, that hook works. It's a little more. There we go. Yeah, it's alright, but okay.
Okay, it's one. Where else am I going? Both places. One up top. I'll come back here for that one. Okay. Three more spots to plan. John Bassan's house. it for Sly's job, so let's have him do one other thing. Check. Turn one directly below me. There it is. Okay. Get that. I'll definitely take you. Ooh, you got a little something, too. Probably just a little something. But... Still, I got a little something on my back. I got a little sapphire. I got a couple of things here. Nope, not today. Alright, see how much cash we got out of that. Not too shabby. I still can't get everything, but I can at least get the expensive stuff out of the way. Really neglected, uh, Murray. So let's uh, let's give him a little spotlight. Okay. Rumor has it that several off-duty guards meet in that cabin for an okay. RC combat club. This is going to be great. I haven't been in any RC combat since that job we pulled in Istanbul. I don't that remember awesome. Istanbul. Whoop. Okay, them slime moves on a hippo. Wait for it. And now I'm in. How did that happen? 
Sly, if you can get the stuffed moose head without being detected, Murray should be able to join the RC Combat Club without raising any suspicion. Okay, that sounds simple enough. Oh, I'm pressing my luck. That would be none the wiser. Not quite. No one's got any glowing pockets. That's unfortunate. Ah, oh, where to start? This particular light seems to be important somehow. There we go. Anything good? Can the camera come with me? Ooh, you do. Excellent. Ooh, hooks. Wonderful. So far, so good. I'm gonna wait for you again. Oh, well that's dangerous looking. Alright, not so bad, not so bad, not so bad. Wait for it. Get dizzy, but wait for it. And pick his pocket. For being foolish. spread over here. Just out of reach. Murray, heads up. That worked out pretty well. No one was any of the wiser. Hey, fellas. Any of you guys think you can beat the Murray? Uh, the moose. Maybe put a bet on it. You're the moose? Oh, I'm in, eh? I ain't got a lot of money for this wager, but there's no way I'd lose to a new guy like you, huh? That RC combat drone takes some skill to control. Okay. Steer with a left analog stick and hold down the X button for gas. After you collect a fallen ammo, press the square button to fire its turret. All right. Here's a pro tip. You can only aim the turret while you're stopped. Okay. He has... Oh! What in the fuck? You won, eh? But I ain't got no money. Oh, wait a minute. It might be okay. It all depends. Depends on what. I thought that I'm having completely On whether or not you know the location of the Northern Light Battery. Oh well, I guess I, think I he's owe frozen. Ya. Oh dear. All right, we actually got through that pretty quickly. Let's uh, let's finish out the day with uh, Bentley, and then we'll get the rest of the jobs done as we go. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Oh, my God. 
not exactly a stealth takedown, but a takedown nonetheless. No, Mr. Bird. No me gusta. Every little bit. Every little bit. Alright, Bentley, you're up. What else we got? Oh, there's another slime mission. Oh, I guess it was a slime mission still. Okay. Well, that gives us a chance to get a little bit more cash anyway, so... Here we go. Sounds good. Unfortunately, it's frozen deep in an ice wall. How are we supposed to get to it? Wait for more global warming? That industrial laser is used to cut through petrified logs. If it can hmm. be bounced out that window, with your help, I should be able to harness its energy to melt the ice wall and free the bug. Cool. How do I redirect that thing? There should be a switch on the other side of this wall. Throw it and then head outside. All right. All right. Whole lot of lights going on down here. My favorite right now. Hmm. All right. No time like the present. Ooh, you got a little something, don't you? And look what else is in here. Take a look at this. If I did my bath right, and I always do my bath right, then the combination has got to be five, eight, three. What do we get? What is that? Lightning spin. That sounds cool. Yeah, Zooks, that's a nice one. All right. I don't think I can really rob anyone else here right now. Out map. Well, hey, you know, you should still enjoy yourself, eh? Hey? I mean, how many people get to come down forests for a living? <laughs> a lot? You all are lucky. Don't ever forget that. Just giving you money. Just giving you money. And taking you out. There we go. It should break the, the window, I would think, but... redirected out the window. All right. Let's play with lasers. Doke. All right, let's go in that now way. Now get that laser pointed at the ice wall, you'll need to alter its direction with the crystals I put in your pouch. I see. I just walk to where the laser stops, place a crystal, and it'll bounce the beam to a new position. That log chopping book is as good as ours. Cool. Alrighty. Right there. Send it up that way. Well, Mr. Moose, I'm gonna steal your money before you get eaten by a bear. Alright, that's going all the way up there. I need to be up, up. Whew. 
Phew. That almost went very poorly. But it didn't. Why would you have saw blades coming out of the top of your building? It seems silly. Good? Oh, yes, you do. Hopefully that bear doesn't attack that other guy and cause this guy to panic. Alright, let's get to the other end. Going this way now. over here a little bit. God damn, why do I always try to jump? Right? Here we go. Stand clear, Sly. Something else is coming out of the deep freeze. Oh boy. I've never seen such a majestic creature. So full he of stopped. life, so ready to live. He's right there. So much for that. He's back in the deep freeze. Is he? I feel like Cheer I watched up, him pal. walk away. We got the log chopping guide. 
All right, seventy-five percent. That's that's a good portion of the game at this point. Let's see what the plan is, and then we'll. After raiding through the log shop, guys, it's become painfully clear that to win in the lumberjack games, we'll have to cheat. Sounds good. Now I've constructed a plan that hinges around us acquiring an eagle's egg, which is more difficult than you'd think. It should be First, difficult. Murray needs to lure a bear into taking out the local oil mains. Once destroyed, uh -huh. the pressurized oil should ignite and create updrafts, which uh -huh. Sly will then use to paraglide over to the eagle's nest, grab an egg, uh -huh. and then head back to the safe house. Thanks to Murray's undercover work in the RC Combat Club, uh -huh. we've learned that the Northern Light Battery is hidden in a silo nearby. Okay. The battery needs some serious modification if we're going to hide inside it to sneak onto Arpeggio's blimp. All right. First, we'll short the battery with grapple lines on local boats. Hmm. Then, we'll all break into the lighthouse and sever the power flow to the battery. That way it won't recharge. Given my electrical engineering background, this plan has a 97% chance of success. Hey. Pretty good, huh? 97% is pretty good. So, I'm, I'm down for this plan. It's a little crazy, but, you know, I think we can make this work. Let's sell some stuff, because I, I did get a few things. Still not enough. We almost got that, and eventually we'll get that. Um, so, yeah, we'll see you guys next time. I'm going to get the rest of these uh, things all squared away, and we'll mo be moving on and beat John Bassan. We'll see you guys then. Bye-bye. Hey, thanks for watching, and if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell icon for notifications. If you enjoyed this video, give us a like, and feel free to check out some of our other gaming videos, our weekly podcast, Anime Yay or Nay, or our parody series, Madoka Magically Abridged. See you next time!